What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have a big new release for basketball, select for off the line. Not in our usual location, but definitely wanted to get this for you guys. And we also have some giveaways. So to enter, like, subscribe, follow me on the live streaming app, whatnot. And then join the live stream when it's time. Information down below, we have multiple boxes and it's a big release. So best of luck, we'll give away pack by pack, many winners, all of the information down below. So here we go. This is our box right here. Not in our usual location, but once again, got to get this big release for you guys. So let me get this uh, box open. Made a small little tear, but everything's still sealed. And get my little cheat sheet to the side. I'll read the information off. So the hobby boxes, SRP, both like 350, I'd say, mid $300 range. First off the line is about like 700. There's our packs. I must say the colors look really good. Really good looking colors. So we'll go like that. Not our usual setup. Please do uh, forgive me. I'll try to do the best I can with what we have to work with. You get five cards in a pack, 12 packs a box, 12 box cases. And then every single box has three auto or mem, which is not the best. Sometimes you get one auto, sometimes it's two, you never know. And 12 prison parallels. First off the line, which this is, has a first off the line autograph and parallel. Auto is to 30 or less, parallel is to 15 or less. And then also look for 11 additional prisms. So a bunch of stuff. The big ones are the zebra case hits. There's the design as we look at it in the light. And then there's also the black one of ones, gold to 10, tie dye, three tier base set. So there's three of all those parallels. And then the black snake skin, the purple and the orange pulsars for first off the line. So look for a color wheel as well. New case hit insert. And yeah, there's the cards. Color wheel, I think was in football in the past, but now they added for basketball. The cases are kind of weird how they do them. There we go, Malcolm Brogdon. Yeah, not the best setup, unfortunately. We're trying to do what we can. And yeah, also the artistic selection is an H2 now, another thing to add. So that is no longer here, which is uh, kind of unfortunate. So look for uh, those in H2. Jaden Ivey, actually let me show you this one real quick. This is, and because we're outside, it's very tough for me to see. So SS, Jaden Sharp. No autograph, but I'll take that. That's a nice little pack right there. A little blue to 249. How about that? Good first pack. Select first off the line is one of the juicier sets, I would say. Juicier. So I like a lot. There we go. Next pack. And the court sides are horizontal. Those are the kind of the big parallels, I'd say. Or not parallels, but uh, base set tier. So look for all that. And what else? That's pretty much it. There's some cool parallels. Three tier, court side, premier level, and then the regular. So Durin, and there's a silver Jake. Put that there. And next one up is super hot. So if I'm sweating like crazy, it is scalding hot out right now. We have something huge coming. So check IG and uh, check out everywhere because we have some big stuff on the way. And there's something flying overhead. We're doing what we can. There you go. The loud fly flying mojo. Trying our best. There's not much you can control when you're outside. Sometimes it's windy, sometimes it's not windy, sometimes it's really hot, sometimes it's loud. That's the, uh, from Pax in Paradise, I learned that the hard way. Yeah, you guys like these reviews, you wanna see more? Like, subscribe, love a lot more. On a bright note, we have a hit here, and the colors do pop a little bit with the light. Jovic, okay. Show me the money. Tricolor, JB. And let's see what this is. LeBron James. Hmm. How about that? LeBron James is not numbered, but that's always a dub. I've sold three cards just like this, prison jerseys, LeBron, and they've all gone for a good amount. So that's a, a good part about it. And I think one was a old one from like 2009. The old LeBron jerseys are always pretty popular. All right, and now we have a silver Jing. And man, this is uh, by far one of the hottest climates I've opened in. And you'll see why, once again, if you're wondering why, Instagram. Instagram, there's a big thing going down that I think everyone would be very excited for. So this could be a hit. It could be, which is interesting because should it be, is the question we need to ask ourselves because there should be a first off the line, which is usually very thick, unless they change it this year. All right, next one up, we got a little bit of bam out of bio. In the past, 
the first off wine RPAs are very patchy and patchy is that a word very um, very thick okay future slush future and let's see what this is um, I actually don't know uh, Tyrese Halliburton that's actually a really nice relic we'll throw back and a little chain link kind of looking design I like that it's a nice looking card is that three hits that is three hits right so do we get a bonus three jersey cards Shaden, LeBron in, in that one so I'm wondering what's going on here something's up it's time we found out it's time we found out the not on location mojo that's well that might be a filler I'm about to say something's going on here and Diabate what else is new I almost put them in the highlight stack. He is not a highlight with all due respect. Coloco, you know where he's going? With the rest of the base. I had some good light here. It's starting to fade a little bit. Better for half than none. What do you guys think about this product though? There we go. There's the first off the line. You guys want to see more, bigger views? Comment down below, like, subscribe. I try to do as many as I can, even when we're not in our usual spot. Or I'm accidentally. There's the court side. It's horizontal. Some people like it. A lot of people don't like it. The hobby in general doesn't love the horizontal cards that much. But, you know, I personally prefer they were vertical. In football, they changed it a lot this year. I'll take that KD. Well, upside down action to 15. 4 of 15. That is a dub. Now we just need our first off the line autograph. And um, I think that's mainly it. We have like four packs left. I'm trying to fly through it before, I don't know, it gets windy. We're losing the light right now. So. And I think we have a filler. We have uh, Tarby Easton, Dyson Daniels. Got some filler action. And, uh, ooh, a little die cut. There's a Nemhard purple. That is to 99. Nice. There you go. And with three left. Got my lucky Jaren jersey on. If you're wondering what jersey I'm wearing, not sure if you can see it or not. But yeah, my lucky Jaren jersey. That could be it right there. That could be something. There's no extra season this either, which is also an L because that's huge for football. We have another die cut. Chet, action shot. Yes. All right, let's see. This one is Jovic. There we are. It's a 249 blue. Die cuts. And I got to flip this. I'm pretty sure. If I'm wrong, I apologize. JCF uh, in flight. Okay, that could be. I don't know. I give up. To 15. Should be purple, I think. Joel Crawford. Okay. Let's take a look. These used to be on card. They should still be. They're nice cards. Last year was a step down, but this year, design's better. Unfortunately, they're still uh, stickers. Used to be beautiful on card autographs. All right, last uh, couple packs here. We have something there. Got some rookie action. Sorry if the lighting's starting to go on us. There you go. And we have a little bit of Suggs. And Donovan Mitchell, cool picture. There we are. Now we have the last pack, and um, I don't think we're waiting really for anything in particular, but let's just see what we have. I think it's an empty box. It's very tough to see. If you ever go outside, and the phone, no matter what brightness, it's impossible to see. So. I'm uh, almost breaking blind here, but trying my best. So, here we go. Last pack. Mojo. Scotty. We have something in here. KD. Clapping KD. And... Ooh. Oh. I saw the Magic logo. I did mention it's kind of tough for me to see. There you go. I saw the Magic logo. I saw courtside. It's, um, it's... Magic. Who could it be? It's Caleb Houston. And... There you go. Well, Patrick Baldwin. So here's a recap. What do you guys think? Overall, I like Select. It's fun. It's some nice stuff. And uh, there's a lot of, lot of parallels. Biggest highlight being uh, our extra jersey cards in the KD, of course. So overall, I like. So from 1 to 10, Select first off the line. And Select Hobby is... I'm not a huge fan of Select Hobby. I think first off the line is way better. I'd give first off the line a 7. And then I'd probably give the Hobby one, like, um, man, like a 5. Point five, even at at the price. I just feel like it's so watered down. We never pull anything from that product. So there you go. Select. 
Not a usual spot review, but try my best. Hopefully it was watchable. And there we go, got some nice pulls today. We'll have giveaways, of course. So make sure you tune in for that. And it does it for this one, guys. Thank you as always for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, I'll see you later.